Once upon a time, ten frogs who loved adventure met at the bottom of a tall mountain. They wanted to climb it together. Their friends and family who came to say goodbye were worried and doubtful. They warned, You can't climb that. You will get hurt. It's not worth it. Better give up now before it's too late. Despite their words of concern, the ten frogs started their journey. They hopped with their small legs, aiming for the top of the mountain. When they were halfway up, they met some rabbits. The rabbits couldn't believe it when the frogs said they wanted to reach the top. What? You guys want to get to the top? No way, no way, this mountain is so high. With your small legs, you can't get to the top. Hearing this, five tired frogs decided to go back. Now, only five frogs were left. They had a steep slope in front of them. After a hard walk through a thick forest, they met a groundhog. Getting to the top is impossible for frogs. You're being brave, but silly. After hearing this, two more frogs decided to give up. Now, only three frogs were left. They kept jumping and moving towards the top of the mountain. Finally, they met some goats who lived high up in the mountains. The goats laughed and said, Just go back now. Looking at you, you won't reach the top even in a month. Hearing this, two more frogs quit. In the end, only one frog was left. It took him a long time, but he finally reached the top of the mountain. When the last frog came down, everyone asked together, How did you do it? The frog only answered, What? So everyone asked again, but louder, How did you do this amazing thing? But he still answered, What? 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 As it turns out, that frog was deaf. You see, when you're climbing your mountain, there will be people who will tell you that you can't do it. If you've never heard that, you're probably not choosing a mountain that's worthwhile to climb. They will say it's too high, it's too hard. This could be your family. And they say these things because they love you and don't want you to get hurt. And then, there might be others who, deep down, don't want to see you succeed because they think it will make them look bad. But here's what I want you to do. Listen to your heart. Trust yourself. Sure, take advice, but take it from those who have climbed their own mountains. Be wary of advice from people who've never made the climb. Always ask yourself, has someone done this before? And if the answer is yes, then ask, why can't I do it too? What do I need to do or work on in order to get there? But what if no one's done it before? Well, here's a favorite quote of mine from Napoleon Hill. Whatever the mind can conceive and believe, it can achieve. Or as David Goggins put it, if you can see yourself doing something, you can do it. If you can't see yourself doing it, usually you can't achieve it. The key here is to first truly believe and see it in your mind that you can achieve it. Belief comes first, then achievement, not the other way around. And lastly, choose to be with those who lift you up. Make friends with people who say, it seems doable, let's give it a try. Not those who tell you, it's impossible, just give up. Surround yourself with people who believe in you, challenge you to do hard things, hold you in high regard, and are truly happy to see you become a better version of yourself. This is Take the Leap Motivation. Thank you for watching. Until next time, stay safe.